Your root. Thanks for four months. HHR pi. Alright. This is it. Madeline. Just breathe. Why are you so nervous? I'm not even feeling nervous. You're doing fine. Oh, it's talking to the character, not me. I gotcha. So this is Celeste. Pretty much perfect play so far, I would say. Am I even allowed to dash it? No. Climb, hold, left trigger. We are Madeline. And we are going to the right at the moment. That's basically what's happening. Excuse me, mate. Hey, Sweet Kona. Hey, Crooked Fade. The sign out front is busted. Is this the mountain trail? You're almost there. It's just across the bridge. By the way, you should call someone about your driveway. The bridge collapsed and I nearly died. <laughs> oh, if my driveway almost did you, and the mountain might be a bit much for you. Clay balls, thanks for three months. He's a tiny. You very awesome, clay balls. Well, if an old boat like you can survive out here, I think I'll be fine. Suit yourself. But you should know, Celeste Mountain is a strange place. You might see things, things you ain't ready to see. You should see Kelp Lady. Jeremy, thanks for Twitch Prime. Bomo show to you too. Oh my. The music started. Ah! Oh no! The bird is here. Dash. Up, right, and X. Oh ho! You think you can dash in other directions too? Or just that direction? You can do this. Alright. Hey, Lee Illinois. Hey, Ellen. Thanks for 28 months. Angpomo showed you as well. Ah, uh, it's been a while. We'll see how this goes. Ah! Okay, that one. We're not allowed to dash before we pick this one up. Ah. You just did a fresh Celeste file two weeks ago and you had a great time? Yeah. Okay, it will be fun. Been a long time. I don't really like remember where everything is or anything. And I only really ever bothered to get the berries once, so a lot of these berries it will have been like, you know, forever since the first time I actually saw them. Hello. Hey, Vesky, thanks for nine months. I'll go more show to you too. Oh, there, fellow traveler. Oh, hi. What a killer night for a hike. I guess so. This place is so crazy, I kind of can't believe it exists. Not the easiest climb, is it? But I guess that's what I was looking for. Whoa, that sounds pretty serious. I'm just happy to see another human in such a lonely place. I'm Theo, by the way, an adventurer from a far off land. Not much of a talker, are you? Mysterious lone wolf type, I get it. I'll just imagine some dark backstory for you. How much of the game did I play? <laughs> Whoops. How much of the game did I play on my old save? Um, I've done everything except for the DLC. Wait, we're back here again. 
You think we can go this way? I bet there are secrets that I'm missing. Like there just have to be, right? Seems impossible that I would get all of the secrets. Oh, I did that again. What about up here? No. Okay. Suck single, how you doing? Is this a thing? Yeah. I remembered that from before. Okay. So there's some sort of code here. <laughs> Fuck, what do we do? <laughs> white, purple, blue, orange, white, yellow? Is that every time? White, purple, blue, orange, white, yellow? White, purple, blue, orange, white, yellow? White, purple, blue, orange, white, yeah. So... White, orange, blue... Nope. White, orange, blue, purple, white, yellow? It's purple, second to left. White, purple, blue, orange, purple, yellow. Okay. White, orange, blue. Which way was yellow again? Yellow, purple, yellow. I did it though. White, orange, blue, purple, yellow. Nope. That was the wrong one. Ah, uh, I'm stuck! <laughs> hey Sandar, hey Sestrin. That's red? Oh, maybe. White. Purple. Blue, orange, purple, yellow. White, purple, blue, orange, purple, yellow. Yeah, I did it. <laughs> Actually, like, actively thought I didn't have it that time, but alright. We've received the heart of chapter one. Pointless machines. And unite. Oh, you know, it's going. Okay, now I'm completely lost. I think this is this is the way we were going though. I wonder if there's anything up here. Yeah, there totally is. Listening to any good music recently? Uh, I watched Hamilton, like just about everybody else. I've been listening to some Black Eyed Peas from 2003. Sort of a jam. Oh, that would be a secret. Okay, and we're back on the main path here. Listening to a lot of Lauren Hill. I'm not sure I know Lauren Hill. 
What is Lauren Hill? Oh, well now what do I do? That didn't work. We could probably get back with corner jumps. Nope. <laughs> Those are like sort of pixel perfect a little bit. That didn't work either. Ooh, this one's a little bit tricky. Alright. Um Is there any sequence breaks in this game? What is a sequence break? Hey, Reginald the Arcane! Thanks for the eight months. I hope we show to you as well. There are definitely a lot of speedrunner things. Like, for example, you can hyper, like, uh... That. What? <laughs> there's a there's a lot of stuff, but for the most part, it's actually intended. There are some skips that were not intended that people have worked out how to do. Skipping large amounts of content, stuff like that. Ooh. Hey. So I guess I've only done this room like once in my life. I don't remember seeing that room like ever before. I've played a good amount of this game, but most of my play has been on the more difficult levels. The B sides and C sides, which you unlock. Wait, I'm not sure I'm ready to go this way yet, because I didn't go right here yet. Yeah. Hey, Surge. Yeah, it should be a really fun stream. LSV is sort of a legend in Magic the Gathering. I've been watching his stuff for at least 10 years. So I'm definitely looking forward to it. You can absolutely dash through walls. Oh, shoot. <laughs> you can do this entire chapter without dashing a single time, so in theory, in theory that's actually doable without a dash. That said, the intended like easy way to do this is that. Oh, see if I can do this. Ah! This is one of the like, no, I need my dash, right? Nice. That's one of the like most obvious. Oh, you can do speedrunner things. <laughs> the things in chapter one, I would say. Ugh, I'm exhausted. Hey, the bird's back. I want to land it on my head. <laughs> this might have been a mistake. You're exhausted too? We got a cozy. Cozy stream for the night. Should we do the B-side straight away, or... Looks like I missed two berries somewhere. Hmm. 
So the B-sides, they're like the same tile set, but more complicated is the idea. And I think they don't have... Oops. I think there are no berries on these, right? Is the game worth getting? Uh, if you enjoy watching it, I would definitely recommend picking it up. It's not the most expensive game, and you can get a lot of time out of playing it, and the uh, people who made it are great, so it's awesome to support them. like the first time you play it where it's all about the story for the most part and then the second time you play it it's more about like getting better and better at the levels and then the third time you play it you can start thinking about like doing things without dying or oh shit I <laughs> or um like speedrunning things and trying to do them as in as little time as possible. I have really not done a very good job on this screen. There we go. bought this game twice for two different platforms. Yeah. You got it on PC and Switch? I definitely know people who play this game a ton on their Switch. How you doing? I am playing on a controller, although people play on keyboard, people play on keyboard plus mouse. Uh, the game's definitely worth playing with those. Control options too. Alright, not the best, but that's okay. <laughs> we got ourselves another heart. It'd be really neat if there was a Celeste Maker, the same way there's a Mario Maker. There are definitely modded levels and stuff. And L7. Hey, uh, fake Nari. Alright, chapter 2. Strawberries will impress your friends, but that's about it. Only collect them if you really want to. One of the most fun things for me about doing another save here is there are definitely some strawberries that I've only ever done once. So I feel like it will be fun to have a reason to do them again. So in the story, we just fell asleep, so we are dreaming right now, is the idea. <laughs> I believe. I believe the idea is that we are dreaming. Mm. So these, you have to get all of them without touching the ground. 
Oh, but that's the ground. Oh my gosh, I'm bad at this. Oh my gosh, I'm bad at this. Nope, lost it. Hey! I'm Koozie. The game has a very good soundtrack. There's another thing down here, right? Yep. Um, I'm pretty sure you're meant to come to this room from the other direction, but I also am pretty sure that you can if you want, like... Oh, I didn't reset my dash there, whoops. How's it going? Thanks very much for the Twitch Prime. I didn't get it there either. It's hard to... I don't know. I don't understand why that resets your dash sometimes and sometimes doesn't. For it. Who this? Thanks very much for the Twitch Prime. I'm going to show you as well. Hafu! Hafu! I was watching you play some League today, Hafu. Huh, and remembering all of the years of my life that I spent <laughs> playing League. You stream 12 hours and your chat is completely AFK. No problem, welcome in. We're just having a super cozy evening playing Celeste, which has to be one of the coziest games of all time. So, if anybody wants to hang out, I'm Jorbs. I usually play more like turn-based strategy stuff on this channel, but Celeste is my, uh, my chill-out game. And so I'm spending some time with that tonight. And if you don't know Hafu, she is an awesome strategy gamer herself. And I recommend you give her stream a follow. I actually don't remember how to do this room. I assumed that like we do that? Oh, that was sort of cool. That was super cool. I was saying we are AFK. You talked 100% of the time you were there. I'm sure she uh, appreciated you hanging out. She's just doing the like understated thing. I'm sure it was basically like a... I'm trying to like a... I'm trying to think of like a big exciting stadium at Mercer thing right now, but like COVID's a thing, right? So I can't actually think of anything that's like that. I just remember there's a strawberry over here that I wanted to get. Yeah, there we go. Basically a rock concert though, I imagine. I hope everybody's having a good evening. Oh, we go this way as well, yeah? I already got the cassette tape. That's one of the cute little speedrunny things you can do in this game. If you're dashing up and then you jump against a wall, you keep your momentum for a little bit longer. You can also, so if you hold a wall, eventually you lose group strength and fall off the wall. But you can do neutral jumps like this, and that actually doesn't use any grip strength. So you can do that forever. There are so many really cool techniques that the devs put in the game to let people work out cool different paths or get faster and faster and faster. And it's built really well, so it's like forgiving. 
like often you'll get an extra pixel or two if you're jumping off a ledge before you fall down and stuff like that. So it just feels really good to play. The AOST is incredible too, yep. Didn't passages suck in most games because they turn the game to pixel hunting or finding a guide? Yeah, I'm not a huge fan of that part of the game, to be honest myself, but I don't know. The game has so much to it. You don't have to do any of the hidden passages in this game, I don't feel like. Madeline, darling, slow down. Who said that? Oh, I'm simply a concerned observer. Are you me? I'm part of you. Why would part of me look so creepy? This is just what I look like, okay? Deal with it. Sorry, I didn't mean... Forget about it. I can't tell you what a relief it is to finally get out of your head. But look, I'm worried about us. We need a hobby, but this... I know it sounds crazy, but I need to climb this mountain. You are many things, darling, but you are not a mountain climber. Who says I can't be? I know it's not your strong suit, but be reasonable for once. You have no idea what you're getting into. You can't handle this. That is exactly why I need to do this. Are you the weak part of me or the lazy part? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the pragmatic part, and I'm trying to be diplomatic here. Let's go home together. Nope. Oh, oh this track is a banger. Ah! Uh, <laughs> This game does have themes of, like, anxiety um, and stuff like that a little bit. It does it incredibly well, but if that isn't your thing, I get it, you know? Come on. Did I ever end up seeing the last ending to this game? Oops. Sorry, I know there's a cassette tape in here somewhere, but I can't remember how to get it. Oh, I remember how to get it. We'll have to go back for it. Not a cassette tape, I like hard. Now I remember it now. Is there? Hold on. <laughs> Is there a berry back there? Oh, there's a berry there. Venus of the hard cell. Thanks for the two months. And Glomo show to you as well. I know how to get up there. Let's go this way, this way, then this way. Nope. <laughs> okay, I had the idea though. Come on. Okay. There was a berry up here. This one's not too hard to do. I missed a strawberry a screen ago. Oh, it's too bad. I'm not gonna like. I'm not gonna go back for it. I'm not really going for 100% here or anything. I'm just, I'm gonna get the strawberries when I see that they're gettable. And if I miss them, you know, it's okay. Some of them I remember, like the secrets as well, and others I don't. Well, let's get that one. That one should be gettable. Actually, how? How do I get underneath this? Wait, what? <laughs> oh, do I go up to it from here? I see. There are five of them now. Oh. And this is the longest screen, I think, so far in the entire game. So we're all the way back here. Whoops. There's a shortcut, though. Like that. Do 
and we're through. And this is the heart cell. I'm glad you've been enjoying the monster train, by the way. There's a new patch for that that I still have to check out, isn't there? There's content coming out on the 16th. Isn't there like a beta branch as well that you can uh, volunteer for? Gleason, thanks very much for the three months. Ogbomo show to you too. Oops. Game is very forgiving of uh dying as well. It doesn't like make you wait forever to respawn. You bolt the burb. Uh, I announced this one on Discord. You should have gotten a ping. Have I played Flower Flower or Journey? Uh, I haven't actually played either of those, but I've been recommended Journey several times. Hello, Madeline. Are you calling from a payphone? Yeah. No, wait, you called me. What are you talking about? It doesn't matter. I'm in trouble. I'm being chased by someone. I don't really understand what's going on, but I know I'm in danger. I can feel it. Madeline, you only call me when you're panicking in the middle of the night. You don't have to make up some ridiculous story just to get my attention. I'm not making it up. You always do this. Shh, it's alright. Calm down. I'm sorry, sweetheart. Talk to me. Who are we calling right now? I'm climbing Celeste Mountain. I found this old mirror and it shattered, but part of me escaped, and I'm dreaming, aren't I? Madeline, of course you're dreaming. I haven't spoken to you in months. Why would I start now? Ugh, why am I even climbing this stupid mountain? Is that like her ex or something? You think it's her mom? Hmm. I'm wondering the same thing. It's time to give up and go home. Oh no! What? The eye monster just... What, that? That's it? That's the chapter? <laughs> uh, so, if we go up here into the sky... Can we go further? Yeah. Oh, the soundtrack for this game is so good. Here's the heart, but the book says there's a dusty old book open on the table. A poem is written on the faded page. An apparition not of this world, but because of it lurking out of frame, awake my heart is a fortress and dreams I am vulnerable. So that tells us we have to try to get up here in the part of the level that we're dreaming in. roguelike game or RPG uh, it's a platformer with a pretty nice story to it there's no like leveling up or anything really uh, there's one way you level up I guess hey Theo sorry about earlier I'm Madeline I've got a lot on my mind well this is a good place for it something about these ruins feels so introspective it's really making me take a look in the mirror so to speak yeah I get that so what far off land do you hail from well my inquisitive compatriot I doth hail from the mystical Enigmatic Kingdom of Seattle. Yeah, that's where I'm from. It sounds like a special place. Alright. I don't think I'm gonna go through like all of the dialogue with Theo every time. Leave that for people who want to discover it on their own. I think um, this is actually going backwards. If you look at speedruns of this game, the way that they get through this part, like carrying their momentum from dashes and stuff, is absolutely ridiculous. It's really, really cool. I think it's the most impressive part of speedruns for me. They get so much momentum built up just by uh, linking dashes together. Oh, I got away. So these strawberries with wings will run away when you dash, which means we have to dash above it to grab it as it's going. 
It was one of the most stressful games to watch being speedrun. The speedrun of every berry, like including all of the berries for doing every level deathless. <laughs> where, where you have to uh, play through like an hour and a half plus of the game just in order to unlock the incredibly difficult levels where you then have to not die for like 10 to 15 minutes in a row of gameplay. That's incredibly challenging. Hello, mom. Madeline, what a nice surprise. How's your trip? This is mom. I think that other one was our ex or something. It's okay, I'm just kind of overwhelmed. Oh no, are you having another panic attack? Focus on your breathing, honey. I'm here. What's going on? We got 15 out of 18 berries so far. We did unlock the B side. I would like to grab that heart that we missed though. So in here, I think right at the start. What would you do with 200 berries? Presumably eat them, right? So there's a thing where your dash resets when you go between screens. Oh, I missed. Shoot. Why did I start playing this? I just felt like playing it today. I've played it before. One of my most played games off stream. Oh, <laughs> come on. Call shenanigans on this one. This one's a little bit, a little bit goofy. It's true. Okay, there we go. Here we are. Resurrections. I just uh, save and quit now. Does that give it to me, or do I have to like finish the thing as well? Yeah, we got it. Oh, but I'm back here again. Return to map. Besides. So again, if you missed it earlier, the B-sides are it's the same sort of tiles, but the levels are a little bit more complicated. You don't collect berries anymore. Usually the B-sides don't take quite as long to play through as the A-side, unless you're like dying all the time on them. But it's like a shorter, more intense version of the same sorts of puzzles. Oh. <laughs> I was reading chat, whoops. Oops. Ah, uh, is this savable? Have an any percent PB? No, I've never bothered timing myself or anything. In fact, this is the first time I've ever like started a new save file and gone from the beginning again. I do have every golden berry except for I 
I'm missing the A and B sides for chapters 3 plus, right? I have all of the C sides and the A and B sides for chapter 1 and 2. So I have completed this without dying before, believe it or not, as you watch me die the same way four times in a row. It's been a little while since I practiced this one a lot. It's been a little while since I played this game a lot, honestly. It's been a... Uh, collecting dust in my stream library a little bit. Steam library? Steam library a little bit. I have not beaten Farewell. Played it like a couple of times. I don't actually like the setting that much, and I don't like the puzzles that much, and I don't like the music that much. And there's this one puzzle that I got completely stuck on both times, and I just like, I was just like, okay, that's fine. <laughs> a different objective than the rest of the game, pushing limits of patience and stubbornness, and also making the player listen to something that sounds a lot like canon in D, like a hundred or two hundred times. <laughs> I got pretty tired of that track. <laughs> 